for a second straight night, an all-Canadian battle, and it'll be the fourth and final meeting between the Abbotsford Canucks and the Laval Rocket. Thanks for tuning in, folks. My name is Brandon Astle, and we got the Abbotsford Canucks wrapping up a busy week of home games. It's the fourth game this week. And now Rathbone trying to play to the slot. It's stolen. Here's a chance. Martel with a shot. Stopped by Di Pietro. Played back in front. And Rempel got tripped. And that'll be a penalty coming up to the Rocket. Off the draw. Lucas Savages taps it back. Here's Rempel with a one-timer. Scores! A goal in three straight games. Sheldon Rempel's up to his old tricks. A one-time blast on a feed from Jack Rathbone. And Jack extends his point streak to four. And for a second straight game against these Rocket, Abbotsford opens a scoring. And that was an absolute missile. Top left circle from Sheldon Rempel, top corner. 4.29 to go, came off a face-off win. And the Canucks wasted no time. Rempel leans into it. And Jinyak. Clears it out of danger and plays it in center. Could be a two-on-one. It's Day with Wah. Day, Wah, shoots and hit the side of the net. Di Pietro might have got a piece of this goal stick. If he did, that would have been an amazing save. Oh, and let's take a look at the replay. Day to Wah, and it looked like he had a side of the net. I don't think Di Pietro got a piece. Here's the best look. Puck was rolling, and yes, it does hit the side of the net. Wu to Rathbone, and Sheldon Rempel tips it in. Poolin behind his net. Backhands it to Matnin. Gave it away. Here's a chance for Rempel alone. Stopped by Poulin. Rebound in front. John Stevens whacking away. Can't get to it. Nearly a costly turnover there. Rempel can't believe it as the Laval Rocket iced the puck. Face off one by the Rocket. Here's a chance for Wallet. Walks in with a shot and they score. Xavier Wallet, the captain, gets Laval on the board off a face off win. Little toe drag shot and beats Di Pietro Club's side. And the Rocket have tied it at one. And what a great shot that was. Now in the middle for Wallet. Teasdale goes in front for the screen. Here's Day on the right board. So the point for Wallet to the left side for Wa. Wa with a shot blocked in front. D with a shot stopped by Di Pietro. Day thinks he scored. Di Pietro came across and looked like he got it with his glove. And Day is adamant that puck went in. Goal light didn't come on. Power plays over in three seconds. Here's Jinyak with a wrist shot. Blocked in front, rebound, and hit the post. Loose in the crease. Di Pietro's down and out, and the Canucks clear it to the line, but not out. Now a shot stopped by Di Pietro. Puck's loose. They're still whacking away. Niku can't hold the line. It's offside. You'll never see fans cheer harder for an offside call than right now. And they're also on their feet, letting Michael Di Pietro hear about it. All sorts of action in front of the goaltender. It's still 1-1. Alfaro going after it at center. Couldn't beat Belpedio to it. And now here's Rathbone leading the rush. He'll wind and fire one, scores! Jackpot! Jack Rathbone! Go ahead goal with 4.27 to play! What a bullet! What a shot across the line, winds and fires over the shoulder of Poulin and the Canucks have a lead. And Rathbone has his second point in the game. And that was on a frozen rope. Poulin saw it the whole way and it beats him blocker side. Day to Niku. Down low to the right wing, sharp angle shot stopped by Di Pietro. Pucks loose, Devontae Stevens is there. Loose for John Stevens to the empty net. Scores! Straight game to the goal. John Stevens, hotter than fish grease. Canucks go up by two, 52 seconds ago. Here's Nico at the blue line. Over to Day, one-timer save. Rebound, play towards the boards. And shot towards the end of the net by Drys, and he just missed. And this game's over. Three seconds left. Can you say playoffs? Game over, Canucks win!